Hi everyone, this is Tracy and I want to invite you Hello everyone, Tracy here again, and I want to take this time to invite you to the virtual scavenger hunt that Tracy Media is sponsoring. The virtual scavenger hunt will be held September the 3rd, 2022, and the cost is $15. And where does that $15 go, you ask? Well, it goes to getting me much needed equipment. I am trying to buy a second laptop so that I can start sharing videos on my live stream. And of course, laptops are super expensive. I wish I had enough money saved to just buy it, but I need your help. Our goal is to raise about $295 with me putting the rest um, in so I can buy the um, laptop that I want, which I'm pricing around $400 and I'm hoping that's enough. But anyway, the virtual scavenger hunt is going to be so much fun. The way it basically works is I'll have a list of a few items that I want you to go around in the house to find. It'll be right there in the comfort of your own home. And we'll have a, a prize and that will be if you win the virtual scavenger hunt, Tracy Media will send you a $25 gift card, a Visa gift card, so that you can buy whatever you want. And we'll have some other fun things that we'll do while we're at the virtual scavenger hunt. And remember, it's September the 3rd, 2022. It starts at 6 p.m. And the link is in the description section. And I'll be playing this every time I have a video because my goal is to have at least 20 people at the scavenger hunt. I really need your support and I appreciate those who are supporting me already. I appreciate you. Um, you don't know how much happiness it brings me to know that I have some people who literally have my back. And so I appreciate all of your support but I want to invite those who haven't financially support my channel to do so. And like I said, that event will be having the virtual scavenger hunt. It's going to be fantastic. We hope to see you there. And like I said, you'll be seeing this commercial quite a bit. So you might as well get used to it. The link to the scavenger hunt is in the description section. We'll see you later and have a fantastic day. Uh, the popcorn in the store, like, oh, jalapeno popcorn. I've never seen that before, so I'm going to buy it. That whole you know store, why you don't see it? <laughs> because it shouldn't be there. <laughs> that whole store, if you want to call it that, which is I really like, just an indoor flea market, I it like screams the store. forced labor. Like the whole thing. I like the store. I buy the unique candy. I like everything about it. The fireplace I like, the menu I like, the granny sampler I love. Love the granny sampler. And on Thanksgiving, when I get that breakfast on Thanksgiving morning, I just roll, oh, nothing better. Nothing better than Crackle Bear, except my number one choice, Waffle House. I don't know how many billion times I've been to Waffle House. I mean, I've been to Waffle House so many times. It's like they already know me when I come in the door because I go to the same one. I order the same thing. Two sausage patties, uh, a waffle, and some coffee. Same thing. I never go, I never deviate that. Sometimes mm -hmm. I'll add that. Tracy skipped the bacon? In this case, I did because their bacon is not thick enough for me. I like thick bacon. I don't like that thin bacon oh you they're like bacon. that bag. yes i don't they they're bacon that's that deadly bacon well if you don't <laughs> eat bacon you might as well just go you know gun ho for it the deadly bacon oh, See, I, get a piece of, I like pizza i like to eat a piece of bacon not a slab of bacon you know what i'm saying not a slab of bacon but i don't like their bacon is too thin for me 
I mean, I'm like, eh, don't like you it. You want that real thin bacon that's crispy after 30 seconds on the grill. Just basic bacon. I don't want oh, the big, fat, oh. fat, fat bacon. What's the point of eating bacon if it's not thick? I'm not trying to chew on shoe leather. Just give it me. It don't taste like shoe leather. Basic you eat, dude. Basic, basic, what do you eat? Basic You're not eating real bacon. food. That's not like real food that you eat. Mm -hmm. I don't know how you open this food. Mm -hmm. you, go, you go in the bacon section and you pick up a package of bacon. No, their bacon at Waffle House is too thin for me. I like my bacon thick. I also like that you can it's put like things like where it. they kill the pig in the back and just put whatever out there out there. I don't know where you go to eat. I get my bacon where they serve just bacon. You are describing bacon where they just killed the pig and it just got done screaming in the back. That's a whole side of pig just just boom. I don't want that. Pig with pig. I don't see what the problem with this is. I literally see no problem with this. So I also you like about waffles. Bacon. You eat waffles that cut the roof of your mouth. I don't I you he really doesn't eat, eat waffles that cut the roof so of his mouth. I don't know what you eating at. I like pancakes. <laughs> I like pancakes. I like no, omelets. Hilarious. I like I don't even really care about bacon, but I like pancakes. I like omelets. And I like orange juice. And I still haven't finished what I liked about bacon. I mean, about Waffle House yet, because I'm still on my number three point about why. So about your food, you like the food. Yeah, and I also like that you can get the hash browns and you can add stuff to them. Like you can add sausage and onions and peppers and oh, you can put it all in there. That's so good. And put some cheese on top. Yes. Here's what I don't like about Waffle House. Will they please clean their store? Because sometimes that floor just be a little too dirty for you know me, but it's Waffle House. And you know, and they need a little bit more space because it's like they're like literally 12 by 12 and that's all the space you're going to get. Those are the only two things I dislike about Waffle House. Everything else, A-OK -okay with me. Tracy, it's really kind of hard to clean that store when you're ducking and dodging bullets. So they're doing the best they can. Yeah. I know they trying, but I'm like, you know, I, I like, I would like y'all to just, you know, take a mop and mop the floor once in a while. Oh, and get some more, um, pews, get some more uh, uh. spaces to sit at because y'all ain't got no seating in there. I'm like, come on, y'all. You get 10 people in there, that store is crowded. <laughs> like 10 I'll, people. I'll give it to you. Sunday is How wrong. many people you Hello, this is Tracy, and I want to let you know that the video that you just watched is just a snippet. And to see the whole wonderful episode, you need to be a Patreon. The link to be a Patreon is in the description section. Please check it out and please support. We need um, as much support as possible. Remember, you can always... Um, subscribe to our page and be notified when we get new videos. But if you want to see the whole video in its entirety, unedited, um, just, just off the cuff, no filters, no anything, be a Patreon. You can start as low as just $1 per month or $5 per month. Um, we'll start to have polls, um, Sometimes I'll drop into the Patreon once we get a couple more members. But again, I just want to encourage you to support us on the Patreon. The link is in the description and have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.